Hallelujah to Jesus. Father, we bless your holy name. We worship you, which shall of days be glorified in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you. Jesus love you. And I love you. Please, family, like this video, share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you. As you do that, in the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Child of God, hear me very well. They are terrified and scared of you. They are out of weapons. They are out of weapons. Every weapons that they have used to fashion against you, all of them is being destroyed. That is why I said, remain fervent in prayer. Because you don't know how, how powerful you are when you pray. It is just like when you, you, are, you are like a lion when you come out from the prayer room. You might walk into the prayer room like a very quiet dog or something that is weak. But the moment you are coming out, you see that your heart, your head is so high. The Lord has filled you. The Lord has spoken to you. The Lord has hold you. You know, there is this Z that just come upon you, the strength that you have. These are the things that terrify them. They are terrified and scared of you right now. Because all their weapons are failing. All their armor tanks are being destroyed. All their opal, their arrows are being returned. And they don't even know how you are doing it because they look at you, they're like, is this small you? Before they started the battle, they look at you like, oh, is it not this small one? We are going to finish her. We are going to finish him. But as they enter the battlefield, they are seeing something different. Please don't forget to share this word. They are seeing something different. They are seeing something different. Someone is not, they are not terrified and scared of you right now. Because they themselves, they are feeling exhausted. How many covenants do they have to make to their Satan? How many covenants do they have to fulfill to the devil? How many sacrifices now that they have to pay for failing to deliver what they promised to deliver? That they cannot deliver. <laughs> they are like, oh, we are going to deliver her. We are going to deliver him into your hands. Don't worry. And at the end of it, they see that the person they, they, they were coming for with full confidence, they see that the person is like a, a fire. It's like a brand that is plucked out from the fire. Surrounded by the angels of God. Child of God, the angel of the Lord bear you up in their hands. You will not dash your foot against a stone. I pray for you, child of God. The Lord equipped you with his word. The Bible says, put on the whole armor of God. The strength for you to put on the whole armor. Receive it in the name of Jesus. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. Now remain your sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.